Welcome to the CTTP training videos. ASTM C31 Standard Practice for Making and Curing Concrete Test Specimens in the Field. This video demonstrates making a 4x8 cylinder using concrete with a slump greater than or equal to 1 inch. Fill the cylinder mold half full. Evenly distribute the concrete. Rod the concrete 25 times with the rounded end of the tamping rod through the entire depth of the layer. Take care not to damage the bottom of the mold. Evenly distribute the roddings over the surface of the concrete. Tap 10 to 15 times with the rubber mallet to close the voids left by rotting and to release trapped air. Distribute the taps evenly around the outside of the mold. For molds which may be permanently damaged by using a mallet, an open hand should be used instead of the mallet. Add enough concrete so that the mold will be full after consolidation. Rod the top layer 25 times with the tamping rod, penetrating the first layer about 1 inch. Evenly distribute the roddings across the surface of the concrete. During consolidation of the top layer, add additional concrete if needed to keep the concrete level slightly above the rim. Overfilled molds shall have excess concrete removed. Tap the sides of the mold 10 to 15 times with the mallet to close the voids left by rotting. Evenly distribute the taps around the outside of the mold. Strike off the surface flush with the mold rim using the tamping rod, float, or trowel. Produce a finish with no bumps or depressions greater than an eighth of an inch. Clean the outside of the mold and prevent moisture loss by covering with a cap. Mark the cylinder mold for identification. Do not mark lids as they are often removed or lost. Within 15 minutes of molding, move the cylinder to its initial curing location. Support the mold from the bottom when lifting. Refinish the surface if necessary. Please visit our website at cttp.org for other training videos and modules.